happy Wednesday evening. I'm News for Jack's meteorologist Rebecca checking in on the latest with your forecast. Our storms were late to fire up today, mainly along the sea breeze, and they're really going to park along our I-95 counties and sit there and drop a whole lot of rain until they fade this evening closer to sunset. And that's going to make for some minor temporary flooding for some areas. But if you don't end up getting the rain like some of our inland areas, it's just going to be awfully hot because we're in the mid 90s for an afternoon high today. But we're eventually cooling down into the mid 70s, whether it's quickly under those downpours or more slowly out where it stayed dry and then we're clearing out overnight don't miss that nearly full moon it was full at 133 this morning so it'll still be big beautiful and bright as it rises this evening your temperatures on their way up tomorrow under mostly sunny skies will race into those mid 90s with more limited chances for afternoon showers and thunderstorms firing up so they'll be more widely scattered there's about a 40 percent chance you'll get rained on tomorrow so it's not going to be bone dry but it will be drier than the last couple of afternoons and that drier trend continues as we get 30 to 40 percent chances for rain on Friday afternoon as well, but that means afternoon highs flirting with those upper 90s, topping out around 97 as a, re as a result of all the sunshine and drier weather. Saturday is the decidedly better day of the three-day weekend with only 40% chances for rain because Sunday and Monday, we're expecting 70% chances for passing showers. So it's not going to be a washout all day, but it will be on the cloudier side and that makes us a little cooler. We're only topping out in the upper 80s on those days. So that's the upside of all those big chances for rain and those sizable chances for rain continuing in next week's forecast, keeping us in those upper 80s, maybe 90 degrees for an afternoon high. For more information, you can read our detailed analysis on newsforjax.com. Have a great night.